Hello everyone. I want to introduce my software CPRM or RTU monitoring. In this section we enter the username and password and if we get rank it's give me a message and after then here is the interface interface of our software. This software need to connect to GSM modem and after installing this software you should detect uh, your GSM modem use which COM port. You can find it easily from this section. Okay, it's used COM3 and in your uh, GSM modem setting you should set this COM, COM3 for that GSM modem. In this list all of your COM ports appear in the combo box and you should select COM3 because COM3 is for your GSM model. This is baud rate. You can set your GSM modem baud rate and also there are another settings for your GSM modem. You should save your settings and after that you can connect the software with GSM modem. Now it's connected to GSM modem successfully and the signal power is 38 percent okay uh, now I want to show you the user manager management uh, you can define uh, users here with supervised privilege or administrator privilege or manager privilege or operator privilege it's depend on your policy and the permission of super uh, supervisor different from another and the supervisor access to all menu of this software okay when we connect the connected button disable and the disconnect button enable because you can use connect button twice because it's connected already and you don't need to connect. This section is GSM modem setting. This section is show the uh, SIM cards content. If uh, your SIM card content is full, you can delete your SMSs from here or you can send your SMSs to database this software uses SQL Server as a database ok all of these SMSs here and you can select all of them and after then you can delete your SMS. Here are uh, our a filter. For example, some SMSs uh, unreaded SMS, and you can filter that SMS. Now we want to delete all of these SMSs. I delete all of them. 
it's deleted one by one and after deleting it show on the show log you can see your SMS's from the SIM cards delete one by one okay in the log file you can see all your SMS's delete if you see the one number it's show you the success successful operation it's the custom send SMS you can write your number here and you can write your text here and after that you can send your SMS let me to insert my now it sends successfully and also it's delivered successfully you can see also the delivers now I received that SMS and that SMS saved to database the software is multi-tab and you can have a lot of tabs here now I want to insert RTU remote terminal unit and TR transformer rectifier here this is our TR list and this is our RTU list and and all RTU maybe have more than one TR we can insert new RTU to this list but I cancelled here and also we can edit existing RTU with selecting that and also we can copy existing RTU to new RTU because they filling all these texts so cumbersome and when if you click to add new it's send you errors okay and now we can insert TR here we want to edit TR okay this is the list of all TRs you can select select this list or you can select all of them you can double click on the TR list now is the interface of the that RTU and it shows the content of that RTU it's monitor that RTU for example current voltage uh, voltage reference oil temperature oil level turn off or turn on the RTU or last update information this section is an associates section it it shows the it, all errors from that devices in he, uh, in this RTU we have two errors and this section is specific commands 
we can execute these commands with sending an SMS to that RTU okay this is specific commands and it sent for just one RTU we can select all the RTUs from the list and filter some of them and when we click on all station status it show that RTU selected and in this section we have global commands and we can select these commands for sending SMS this is our SMS list if we click on SMS that SMS is sent to all RTUs now in the specific command we can set voltage for example we can set current and also another specific commands for that RTU or turning off or turning on here the turn on is disabled because that RTU is turned on already and I want to test by sending an SMS Okay, this is the property of that station with that GSM modem number if we send the SMS it select to that it sent to that number when I click on send SMS all your commands generated and if you send SMS it's start to sending an SMS if it's check mark one time that show you it's your SMS sended but if your uh, you have two check mark it show you your SMS is delivered also because it's device that device is not turned on our uh, we don't get delivery report from that device I should try with another number okay okay now we can show in the show log all sending send SMS but we didn't get delivery report okay let me try with another numbers okay let me check with this number yes okay now I want to test that commands for another RTU now it's a start to sending SMS's the SMS2 is sent okay and here we can show the SMS reference number okay now I get delivered that SMS's you can show the two tick, mark, two tick marks here ok all your SMS's send up and now uh, you receive the delivery report this software written 
multi-thread and all the operation running from another thread, thread. okay now you get all of the delivery reports and you show that your SMS send it to that device and, not, and now that device want to reply to your SMS we have chart section that show your data chart, chart. you can change the date easily you can show the chart you can plot your data and you can filter from this section which option do you, do you want now you have nothing okay okay this is my software. I hope you enjoy it.